For the first time since March 10th, 2020, fans will actually be inside Chase Center. Health and safety protocols are everywhere around the building, but fans tell me they're just excited to be back. Signs everywhere were a constant reminder that health and safety is the top priority here at Chase Center. Please, everyone, have your vaccination card and your ID ready. In order to enter, you had to have a proof of a negative COVID test or full vaccination. I'm content with the safety protocols and then the, the at-home testing. It wasn't long. It was a pretty short process. Just getting back, seeing my friend I hadn't seen since last November and the atmosphere of people. Warriors, baby, Warriors, let's go! Baby, let's go. Anthony Calvo was the first Warrior fan to enter Chase Center on Friday night. The team needs us. Uh, you know, we feed off the team, but the team feeds us. And now, you know, now we're here and, you know, after a long, long year, we're able to go in. Just super exciting. Why was it so important to be back in the first game you could? Because we've been missing it for so long. I mean, we've just been itching and aching and dancing and prancing and it just can't wait. How long have you waited for this game, this night? I've been waiting forever. <laughs> Feels like forever. What is your message to the fans uh, to come out here and get them back at Chase Center? My message is I hope you guys have a good day and stay safe. So after tonight, eight more home games remain here at Chase Center in the regular season. Larry Beal has the highlights of this game tonight coming up in sports. Let's send things back to you.